the celebrity for the academicians, global academicians, those who were contributing, those who were participating in the international events, conferences, having the publications, and they are also the winner of FMERU award from us. So we are congratulating you for such an academic achievement in your career. And now also he is pursuing his PhD. So namaste from our side. And it's the honor for the Edoxia family to have you like the academician with us and in this edx so we will try to encourage the researcher and academician to take you as a, one of the role model that they can follow your steps you have to share so first we wanted to start with your introduction so may i request you to introduce from your side uh, okay thank you so much sir uh, it's my uh, great pleasure and i'm really very much pleased uh, that uh, you have uh, introduced uh, me in a very pleasing and very wonderful way. I myself, uh, Chetan Acharya, uh, I am from Nepal. Uh, I'm living in Kathmandu and I am a lecturer of economics. And then I am doing PhD from uh, Thailand. Uh, besides this, I own one research firm and I work there as a research director. And then it's uh, really, thank you to my God, uh, it's my great uh, um, uh, chance. I'm very lucky to be a part of Edoxia family. It's really wonderful, wonderful, wonderful experience and opportunity to me to be a part of this Edoxia family. Thank you so much for the entire team of Edoxia family. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you so much. I'm really grateful to you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you very much for such a wonderful message. Now we will make it more interesting. We will have the interaction with our guest. And today we will come to know about the challenges that he faced in his career, the overwhelming moment that whenever we are feeling the full joy, that's yes, it is also happening. I have made that one. So first I would like to know from your side that the moment that you want to share, that the moment which make you the joyness, that happiness that you are receiving, that you feel like that, yes, I am in the seventh cloud. I feel like that I am the super happy person. So what was that moment? Please share with us. We are here. Actually, know. that moment, actually, I am frequently in one-to-one uh, -one correspondent, one-to-one -one talking with uh, respected uh, Dr. Sukhwinder, sir. Thank you so much, sir. I am frequently talking with him personally. I am every time I am bothering him but he is every time he is encouraging me, he is supporting me, and he is behaving me like his little brother. Thank you so much, Sukhvinder, sir. I'm really grateful to you. Thank you so much. And besides this, uh, I am very much in impressed with the uh, various sessions uh, given from the various scholars, various researchers, various uh, academicians. Uh, I have such wonderful platform I have joined such wonderful platform to learn many things about research. I have learned uh, from topic selection to uh, data analysis and reference management. I have got lots of benefit from this. Really, I am very much wonderful uh, to you. And beside this, uh, I'm once again, I'm really very grateful to uh, Dr. Sukhvinder Singh, sir, because he always, always, always is replying instantly, he's replying me, and then he is trying to solve my personal queries, and he is behaving me like his little brother. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you so much. I'm very grateful to you. That was that was wonderful. And I think that our Dr. Singh also wanted to uh, share a few moments with it. And uh, he is the register, so he is always supporting. And uh, thank you for sharing the message. One message from maybe Dr. Singh also here regarding this, his message. Thank you. Thank you so much. And uh, it's uh, always a price. Uh, and uh, I'm so delighted today that uh, Chetana Charya sir is here. Uh, sir's uh, contribution in terms of uh, academics, of course, he is starting his research journey and is learning a lot, and we are always a learner. And every time Sir's queries come in our doxia, I always feel that uh, they are a big family. So Sir is a part of our family, 
and we have to help. And this is our commitment. So okay. thank you so much, sir. And congratulations that you are in our we family and we always ready. 24 into 7, we definitely help you. Thank, thank you. you. Thank, thank you so much, sir. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you. Thank you very much. That was really wonderful interactions. And he was sharing that he was getting the full support from the resistor. And uh, most of the time, he always feel like that, the younger brother. Now, uh, let us move forward. That's uh, very hey, hey, one, one thing I want to add, sir, especially I want to express my sincere thanks to uh, Mr. Samiran Dekha, sir, also, because he is also uh, responding me is very, very, very promptly. He is responding me and then he is sharing all the um, issues. He openly, uh, he shares me and he is responding me. That's why uh, from my heart, I want to express my sincere thanks to uh, Samiran Dekha sir also. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you so much. That's great. That's great. We have come to know that our, uh, that's uh, DGM now Samiran was uh, supporting and uh, today also he is becoming the DGM and we are uh, that super, I think that exciting moment we are having. And uh, now we would like to move forward and whenever the researcher are entering into the research, the first they are feeling like that I need the publication. So at least the two points, two major points you wanted to share with them that how they can go for their publication process. At least the two suggestions from your side. Okay, uh, for the uh, publication process, first uh, we need to consider on what journal, which journal we are going to publish. The first and the most important thing is uh, the selection of appropriate journal. The most important thing is this. And the second is uh, the requirement, author's requirement uh, of the journal. I consider these two things. One thing, requirement, and another is the selection of journal. These two things are the most important thing uh, for the publication process. That's great. Wonderfully explained that whenever I would like to share here, the new researcher wanted to go for public. It's a very simple way he was sharing like that. Please find out the right journal. The journal selection is very important. That which journal I wanted to publish my work. And secondly, the fulfilling the criteria. Yes, making that's the quality. Making the standard of the journal is very important. Now, I would like to take the opportunity to have one question from our director, Professor Dr. Rajesh Kandrusar. The big hand for our Kandrusar is the true academician and they're always giving the inspiration to the researcher. So here we have one question uh, from our uh, director, uh, Professor Dr. Rajesh Kandrusar. Thank you, sir, for an unmuted. Namaste. Yeah. Namaste. 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 A hearty welcome uh, to uh, Chetan Acharya, sir. Okay. Uh, Just I want to uh, ask you, okay. What is your uh, enjoyment, Miss in a research journey? Okay, what do you want to achieve? Uh, nothing more, sir. Just I want to uh, in get, uh, just enjoy with new things. I want to learn new things. I want to travel new places. I want to make a new uh, connection. I want to join. I want to make a new family like Edoxia. And uh, this is uh, actually the entertainment, enjoy of our benefit of uh, joining in this research journey. Just, I just uh, want to get entertainment. I want to enjoy with this research career. Thank you. Because Thank of, you. I, I, I get lots of things. I get opportunity to know lots of things from this journey. Thank you. Thank you. That's great. That's great. And now we are moving to our next question. It will be a very interesting question. And you are now having, okay, that's uh, you are you are saying also the traveling part also that's uh, now our question is like with the three options and you are now can select anyone and why you need to answer sure, you sir. are having opportunity say god blessing with you and god say it to you you can make one invisible man okay the research is going on and you are having the blessing like that the magic in your hand you can make option a invisible man Option B, you can make the time travel. It is also very, you know, the super exciting part. That is the time travel. You can travel to any era, any parts that the time is in, in your hand. Yeah. Okay, now th that will be not the science fiction. Say, the opportunity come. Number three, make immortal human. Okay, make immortal human. Number four, artificial intelligence 
embedded inside the human. That is the human. What you want to make and why? Actually, we are at the um, science of technology. We are the uh, at the time of science and this is the era of science and technology. That's why um, I want to go with blending form of these all the options because all these options can make us to enter into the better world of, world of research. Because if we go from the one side, one perspective, then we may not get the perfect knowledge of research. What do we want to achieve? We may not achieve. That's why we need, in one side, we need science and technology also. We need human behavior also. We need everything. That's why uh, I want to go the blended form of these all options. Okay, all right, thank you. Thank you for your answer. I would like to also have some comments from our uh, say director, from our register, that if you have the four options and the select one, what will be your one? Let us make it interesting. And we are discussing that uh, the innovation is here. And one innovation you have to choose that out of this four. So what will be say register choice? Uh, sir, I think I will go for invisibility. Um, because going in the past, I mean, we already lived and so already documented. So I want to see something which is uh, which is beyond the dimension. So I will go for invisibility in that part. And uh, uh, one actually a question to our Chetan Acharya sir, one very short thing, because since we are now we're going for a submission in a, in a Q1 journal. Uh, so what do you think that if we, uh, we have submitted, let's suppose we have submitted in the Q1 journal and you got the publication, so what will be your celebrations uh, in terms of the acceptance? Please let me know, sir. <laughs> that uh, I have not uh, uh, thought uh, till date. Uh, I'm just worrying about how to get published there, how to make access there. Just I'm worrying about that. And I didn't think I have not planned how to celebrate after the acceptance. <laughs> that will be really the wonderful moment. That will be the wow. That will be the wow. So. Uh, I'm not thinking about that part, but now just I'm worrying about how to get acceptance. Just only this. Yeah, in Edoxia, let me tell you, sir, in Edoxia, I mean, since every scholar comes across 193 countries, whenever they come, uh, we always want them to understand that you should learn. Uh, as our honorable president, sir, is here, our director, sir, is here, you see the live demonstrations, you understand these things and you can execute. So I'm sure. Uh, we will have the success story also uh, for you. Yes, so sir. congratulations from my side. Good luck thank also you so to you, thank sir. You so thank, much, thank you. Thank you, sir, thank for you. meeting me. Thank you. Thank you very much. And uh, I would like to have here also director comment. That's uh, if Condors are also getting this poor option, that to select one innovation mm -hmm. in your hand, like uh, the time machine, invisible man, humanoid, which full of AI, more than human intelligence, and uh, I think that the one more option was there, uh, that total four option, invisible man, time travel is there, immortal, immortal in human, and also the AI, humanoids. So what will be, sir, your choice that uh, our register mm -hmm. said that uh, invisible man, then uh, I think that the HG Wells now will be, <laughs> sounds good here. So what will be your choice? Uh, thank you, sir. I, uh, it is very tricky question you are asking, <laughs> and a very complex one. Yeah. Uh, according to me, I want to become an immortal. Okay. <laughs> yes, sir. That's immortal. That uh, we have seen also. I want to share that uh, yes, immortal. That's time to time. There were challenges. So many people. If we go with the mythology, I think that uh, we know about Ravana. That's yes, uh, that Ramayan. Ravana was also trying to get the immortality, and he was asking. That's the blessings from the Lord Shiva in such a mortality to immortal that is the highest uh, our yeah, the highest of and uh, actually but anyhow counselors unto you also that's for such a wonderful wonderful message so actually what I want to share that uh, yes as Kondusar said immortal we should love human and we should love our life it is also yeah. very our life is that whenever you are having the option then you will remember we have the short span of our life Yes. That is, we are not having the 300 years, 500 years in our hand. Mm -hmm. Very short life, and we have to make it remarkable. We have to make it such yeah. a way that uh, in the future also, in the generation by generation, they will remember the academician. Academician, yeah. maybe not the faster celebrity 
in his own time, but they are the permanent celebrity for all time. That is we need to understand. Yes. That is, maybe Albert Einstein was not that much popular that like in his time of the say singers, if you consider even the maybe Madonna, maybe the more popular in that time. But era yes, and era, wherever yes, sir, is, I, I want to interrupt here. You see that Arabata, nothing was there. The that whole is, world was not at all knowing a pen and paper, not pen and paper, how to write also. Yes. And yes. he has discovered zero because he has discovered now we are talking with you and uh, we are uh, engaging. Yes. Otherwise, if he has not discovered zero, still uh, today also there are theorems are going on. How he has discovered zero? Here, here only nearby in a railway station, Kogol is there, sir. Yes. Okay. There, yes. they are in, uh, doing a research on uh, how he has discovered zero, the theory of zero. Yes. See the uh, Miss, uh, he is the one more son in, in, in mathematics and uh, what you call in physics. Yeah, yeah. He is the actually, we can say like that one of the father in physics, especially for and dear for father of father, he is. <laughs> yes. And he is starting from zero no. and to the all laws that dare for the India, whenever making the satellite, they named it. Yes, Ayur, uh, that that was. No, without so, zero. Uh, we could not, uh, there was no, uh, this, uh, what you say, and even Palini, Nalini, these are all greatest mathematicians. Yes, they have yes. contributed uh, and uh, uh, still people are in uh, following and uh, still they are doing in PhD on them, how, uh, you know, it has been established. Yes. So that was wonderful contribution and big hand to all these great academicians of all the era that we are discussing. That from say Albert Einstein to Ajay Bhatta, that's we are discussing about the academicians, their contributions. But sometimes what is happening, I'm sharing here, <clears throat> whenever you are motivating the student also, you are expecting some big big throw from them, but they are unable to do it. And they are sharing the excuses. So now I would like to know from our guest, that Chetan Asaria, what was the biggest and the funny excuses you have received from your student. Say you were with the student, someone learning from you, and you are expecting something and they are giving now excuses. You know that this is ex excuses only. Actually, they can do much more better. And uh, you are remembering that funny incident. You can share with us. Yeah. Uh, sometimes uh, in classroom also, I always uh, just uh, enjoy with the student. Sometimes uh, I get um, some unanswerable and unsolvable questions students they raise in the classroom. Sometimes they uh, unexpectedly they ask such type of questions. For example, when the world has begun, how the world has begun, what is the nexus between science and uh, our mythology? They, they talk in uh, religious mythology, they, 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 they talk, they, they uh, talk about uh, scientific uh, fact and then uh, religious fact. And then I, uh, in such situation, uh, I, I just, I convince them by telling, it's all about your situation. It's all about your fact or it all about your uh, evidence. What evidence you have in front? You believe on that. Don't go beyond that. Just I <laughs> say this and then I try to convince them. Because I believe on evidence-based reality. What I have in front, what I have uh, evidence in front uh, my, I believe on that. That's why don't go such um, unanswerable things. What you have, uh, what uh, evidence you have in front of you, believe on that. That was wonderful. Wonderfully explained. Please give the big hand. Thank you so much. Sir. So I would like to know from your side, that the inspiration, that in our childhood, we have the different inspiration. So many people, role models are there also. They are also sharing so many things. And in the childhood time, we are being confused. Whether I wanted to be the academicians, I wanted to be the doctor, I wanted to be the engineer, I wanted to be the entrepreneur, industrialist, whatever it may be. Okay, maybe the actors. Because the child are open to everything. And their thought process is also multidimensional. What was the incident that you wanted to share with us? Just remember 
which provoking you, encouraging you to become the academician. What was the incident? Uh, thank you so much, sir. Uh, that incident was when I was in, I think, I class six or seven uh, at I, school level. When I was there, uh, one day, my teacher asked me, okay, uh, in classroom, uh, he told to share all the students to share their own dreams. Then at that time, unexpectedly, I said, sir, I will be doctor. I will be PhD doctor. I will be academician. I don't know how that answer came. I don't know even how PhD is done at, at that time. I, I didn't know at that time. But from the, my core uh, of heart, that spontaneously, that was uttered. Then uh, when I was in class 10, uh, I have seen one of my uh, neighbor. He is traveling all around the world in many conferences. Sometimes he is attending Japan, sometimes America, sometimes Canada, sometimes Europe. All around the world he is traveling. Then I too came, I came to realize that oh, if I do that line, then oh, I'll get such opportunity to see the around around the whole world. So why not to catch such path? Why not to um, follow him? That's why I uh, just followed his path and I came at this stage. That's great that the story you have shared. Now, uh, say if you are not becoming academician, think, just imagine that you are not becoming academician. You are not doing your PhD. You are not into this work. So how you want to define yourself? What will be maybe the next choice? Whether you will be singer, you will be actor, we, you will be policeman, you will be doctor. What will be there? That, what will be the second choice? That you may feel like that if I am not academician, then maybe I can be this one, this position. Oh, uh, okay. There was, a, uh, since I belong to Brahmin family, you know Brahmin family, eh? Okay, uh, I belong to Brahmin family. And then my uh, father uh, always, uh, he, uh, do you know priest? Priest, Pujari? Yeah, 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 priest. Yeah. Oh, he, he, he always pro, uh, do, he, he perform such type of activities. And then there was a pressure to become, uh, to, to, to learn such, such um, line. And then I uh, really, from the, my, from inner, from core part, uh, mm -hmm. um, I, there was no interest to learn about that Sanskrit. To, in Nepali, it's a karma kanda. Uh, I, 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 would not, I was not interested on that. And then I always, uh, at that time also from the, my childhood life also, I always try to learn something new. I always try to uh, seek new things. That's why uh, I really um, just, I didn't go with the family pressure. I didn't care of my family pressure. And then I just followed my, um, I say him uncle, my, I, I, I followed my uncle's path. That's why if I were not such academician, then I would be, I think, such priest. That's a great answer. And the process to you, it's all, yeah, in the rituals part that priests are performing are challenging also. I think that. Yeah. And therefore, it's a really noble work that they are doing in a different way. And those who are on the right part, they are also encouraging the people. If they are into the right part, then they are encouraging the people. Also. Anyway, let us move forward. And now I think that one question from our uh, Kannur sir as the director. We are coming towards the end of today's discussion and it is becoming the more and more interesting. That's yeah, it. Yeah. Uh, that's yeah. so many. I think that the story we have opened up here and uh, it's a really, uh, that's a super Thank happy you, Thank moment you. for Thank us. You. Of so, course, uh, uh, well, when I uh, come to know Chetan Achary, Achary is the post-graduation, those who are done earlier in Sanskrit, yeah. they used to get as an uh, professor, okay. Achary is nothing but a uh, professor in an... Uh, uh, New year term, but earlier they used to give as an acharya. Okay, yeah, yeah. very nice. It is, okay. it is, it is uh, like academic degree. Uh, okay. Academic, okay. Those if you are teaching in Sanskrit University, till uh, uh, now also they will give as an acharya. Yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> mm, very nice. Of course, it is an like, uh, uh, real knowledge. While doing, while doing PhD, uh, we had a uh, doctor uh, like uh, in Sanskrit, 
uh, um, they, they they give uh, acharya that surname <laughs> yeah. earlier uh, earlier in the system but of i'm i'm by birth acharya <laughs> yes yes so i came to know okay of course it's the good one okay uh, anyway you have, you have to practice it whatever is there the traditional things okay because uh, it has given culture to us from there only we have grown it and uh, whatever the sanatana dharma is there it is the true dharma okay it is the ultimate one nobody will deny it okay? that is another part of life another part of, of course life. of course hmm. of course okay yeah and at the end we have to surrender surrender to it <laughs> the divinity okay yeah. then uh, one more thing just i want to ask you at the last question uh, how you what you thought about in uh, the next life you tell me next life uh, the continuation of this academic life nothing beyond this <laughs> just uh, i want to see around the world because uh, recently uh, my one paper has been accepted in spain in october i am uh, probably i am traveling to europe uh, i am traveling spain uh, and then for this uh, i want to uh, give my sincere i want to express my sincere thanks to mr dr sukvinder singh sir uh, he is also supporting me in this direction uh, so Uh, in october i am traveling to europe and then uh, in uh, rest of the my life also i want to see around the world i want to just gather i want to see i want to join with this uh, different families like indonesia and i want to share knowledge i want to learn new things i want to learn new knowledge i want to see new world i want to interact with new people and this is the continuation of my rest of the life this thank you thank you thank you Thank you. Thank you very much. And uh, one more question from our uh, register, Dr. Subhinder. Uh, thank you. Thank you so much, sir, for meeting me. And uh, first of all, uh, congratulations to Chetan Acharya, sir. This is wonderful. I would like so much, to thank, you thank so our much. honorable president, sir, for his gracious present today. in this edx talks is very rare that sir has presented and it is uh, it is so beautiful actually uh, to know your story uh, i just have uh, uh, one um, message that is uh, uh, keep doing the hard work always be in the learning phase we are all learning day and day uh, also edoxia is the one of the best platforms in the world which is actually nurturing learning processes we always uh, love our family members and you are one of uh, them so keep learning and i'm sure you will thank get you so success much, thank you so much stories. it's my great pleasure uh, <laughs> and we are always there to help as well and our honorable president sir has only one uh, motto in terms of the academicians and the global researchers that this is the one platform where you can actually involve and learn the things together and execute it in such a way that uh, you know the world will can see and learn from us so thank you so much uh, our honorable president sir for this wonderful wonderful platform and thank you so much our director sir for this gracious present and of course our guest today chetan acharya sir and i'm sure many more things good things will coming soon uh, I, i i can feel that also thank you sir uh, very good evening from my side thank you thank, thank you so much sir thank, thank you so much uh, for providing me such a wonderful platform uh, to be joined uh, to be inter to interact with such a renowned person uh, thank you so much uh, this edoxia family uh, for uh, making uh, me as a part of this family and providing such wonderful opportunity thank you so much again thank you thank you and please give a big hand for asarya i am saying that asarya set in you know. yes it should be like that also that uh, as the conductor said and he was also sharing that uh, even in ancient india also those who were some universities they are also using asarya because yeah. uh, uh, the designations are somewhat different professor associate professor assistant professor the asarya part was also there there after we have a professor reader that's a assistant professor lecturer like that so uh, i would like to share here that the contribution that uh, made by the chetan asario i think that we encourage researcher and academic to select their life in this domain this is very important. yes because whenever we are into this world anyway most of the countries that the people will not die by without eating they will eat they will live their life whatever it may be the biggest challenge is that to encourage other people 
for the betterment of the humanity. That is the best part. We may have the numbers of papers, we may have the numbers of publications, numbers of award in our life, and maybe the numbers of achievement as far the public viewpoint. Maybe we are becoming the famous or maybe not famous. But the real, I think that the happiness will come whenever you are bringing a smile to your followers, whenever you are bringing a smile to the humanity. And I think that in that case, as Satan Asaria said, and also he appreciate our register or other officer seminar, and he said that he is trying to contribute more and more and into the world. And he is ready for his contribution into the European countries also. He is now working with the other countries, he is from Nepal. So our best wishes with him for his future and the world. So big hand Thank you to- so much, sir. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you so much. And it's really wonderful and really very, very exciteful uh, happiness to me. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you very much. I think that this EDX talk will give that Chetan Asario also the one smile to his life. It should not be the one talk. It should be the sweetest memory to be shared in the future. In this really, evening. really grateful. Really grateful to you, sir. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you very much. And I think that those who are watching us and we are in the Facebook Live also, and I think that's the million people are watching and will watch those video and they will be encouraged by this kind of talk. So this kind of discussion. My sincere appreciation to Satan Asario for such a wonderful contribution. Really, thank you so much. Appreciation to our director, Professor Dr. Rasis Kannur, sir. Special appreciation to our register, Dr. Subinder Singh, and everyone. That's it. We can see here that the Binut Eka is, sir, is also here. Everyone, those who are watching, those who are in the Facebook and in other social media that you are watching us. So we are also inviting everyone, academicians, to be the part of Eudoxia Fidel. We are here to support you, to show you the path. Let us work together. Let us work okay. together. Really, to really, really, it, it is really a wonderful platform. And I'm really grateful to you. Thank you so much. And to the entire team of Edoxia family. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. We are winding up the discussion. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you.